Den förra presidenten Donald Trumps sociala mediealternativ till Twitter lanserades den 21 februari, ungefär ett år efter att han blivit avstängd från Twitter, Facebook och Youtube. Andrew Selapak, professor i sociala medier vid University of Florida, säger att Truth Social kan vara en plattform som erbjuder nya perspektiv och idéer. A lot of the social media platforms have been limiting certain voices, certain topics. We know this has been true when it's come to COVID. We've seen how this has played out recently with Joe Rogan in different ways. We've also seen how it's played out with the Canadian trucker protest. And True Social, much like Parler, much like Rumble and some of the other platforms before it, has supposed to be the platform where there's going to be allowing more free speech. Men han tillägger att det fortfarande kommer att finnas vissa gränser. You still can't incite violence. You still can't have um, certain content that is offensive as it breaks some of the laws when it comes to indecency. Selapak säger att sociala medieplattformar har rätt att bestämma vad som får och inte får sägas på deras plattformar. So we have to understand that the platforms can basically limit and prevent anything that they want from being said and, and cut down any voices and ban anybody and, and you know basically take down any content that they find disagreeable based on their terms of service. Truth Socials riktlinjer för appen säger att företaget inte kommer att ta bort eller filtrera innehåll baserat på politisk ideologi eller ståndpunkt. What we're going to have to wait and see is to what extent they're going to moderate the voices and the content that's on there and at this point it's still kind of up in the air. It would be good, it would be nice, it would be helpful. I think a lot of people would say to have a competing platform out there. Men han tillägger att funktionalitet kommer att vara den utslagsgivande faktorn om Truth Social blir en framgång. Selepak påpekade att de två största skillnaderna mellan Truth Social och mainstream sociala medieföretag är One, Donald Trump is going to be on it. Uh, you're talking about probably the most famous person in the world who is banned from other social media platforms. And the second biggest difference is that the other social media platforms actually work. Um, right now, Truth Social has been out for hours and no one really seems to be able to log on, create an account, confirm their account or use the platform to know exactly how it's going to work, what it's going to look like and what it's going to do or how many people are even on it. Appen Truth Social fanns tillgänglig i Apples App Store men stötte på tekniska problem kort efter lanseringen och prenumeranter hade problem med att logga in. Uh, if they're having this much trouble just getting people to sign in, just getting people to create an account, you know, that's sort of the easy part compared to actually running the account, to actually making it user friendly, allowing enough people to post and share content. Uh, so a lot remains to be seen in terms of how True Social is going to end up and, and how well it's going to perform. Enligt Apples rankning var Truth Social den populäraste gratisappen i USA på måndag morgon. Men appen kanske inte är helt i drift före nästa månad.